Hi everyone. Do you know how many students commit suicide every day in our country? Yes. Every hour, one teen commits suicide. Who is responsible for this? We need to think. You and me need to think about it. Who is responsible? We all are responsible for this act of our children. Teachers, parents, adults, the society as a large, when you think, we are responsible. The way we talk to our children, that has become their inner voice. The way we speak about them, that is their life stories. Dear friends, we need to see how we interact with our children each and every day. We need to create a wow feeling to our children. That is important. What is this wow? What am I trying to speak about this wow? The wow indicates that first W speaks that you are worthy. You are a wonderful creature of God. And this wow creates that I accept you as an individual with all your limitations and you are worthy in my life. Parents as well as teachers and the society you should think about the child in this manner. Second thing, O. Oh, what is this O oh speaks about? We need to think that our children, each one is an important person in our life. They have their own originality. We need to see they are original. They have their own uniqueness. We need to understand their uniqueness and we need to accept them with their own limitations. We should never compare with our children with others because everyone, every individual, every child is a unique. It's a gift of God. We need to accept that. Third W, what is speaking about? We need to welcome. Third W is speaking about. We need to welcome. We need to welcome the child with their own limitations and we need to accept our children in our heart. If we are able to create this wow feeling, worthy, original and welcome, I am sure that we will be able to create a better society. Be adults, be teachers, be parents, until unless we create this wow feeling among the children, we are not able to create a change in them. Dear all, we need to do that and let us create a, a better society, a wow feeling in their heart and minds. Thank you.